Hey guys, okay, so this is just gonna be a really, really quick video on how I draw my eyebrows on because I get so many questions on how I do it, so I didn't wanna do it in the middle of one of my regular videos, so this is just a quick, quick tip video on um, how to do the eyebrows, so let's get started. Okay, so I'm really gonna zoom this in for you guys. Ooh. I wonder if that's too close. Um, hopefully it's not. Okay, so you can take like a mixing medium. Was, can you see that? You can take like a mixing medium if you wanted to, but I'm not really, I don't really do that. I just lick my brush. So this is um, a MAC 266 brush. It's just a small angled brush. You can use like any companies. This is the Smashbox angled brush, but you just want one of these small ones that has like um, a little obviously angle like that. Um, so I'm just going to take a, a brown and you can see that I've really used this uh, brown like crazy. This is a Jane Ardell palette. Um, you can't even see that because it's so small right here. Um, this looks creepy just like talking without you guys being able to see my, my mouth moving. But um, if you're a blonde, they say that you want to be two or three shades darker in the eyebrows. And if you're a brunette, they say you want to be two or three shades lighter. Or Yeah, two or three shades lighter. So what you want to do is you just want to take like anything that's got like a little bit of a brush on it or this. And you guys all know about plucking and grooming your eyebrows. You just want to create a nice shape, right? So you're just going to brush um, your eyebrows up. I like to brush mine up anyways. And I, I like to do my eyeshadow first. I know some people like to do their eyebrows first, but I just think it looks better when you do your eyebrows after. I feel like once you get the highlight on, and then if you dry your eyebrows, it gives it a nicer shape. So I lick my brush. And you can use the mixing medium if you want, but I'm just lazy, so I don't. And then I take my um, shadow, and I just, I, I draw like a line in the shadow. So I just draw into it. And then I come up, I'm going to grab a mirror right here so you guys can see better. I come up into my, maybe I should just do it like this. Um, maybe I'll do it on this eyebrow because you guys can see it there. I come up, I start at the corner here and I draw a line and I slowly feather the line. And my trick is is that I actually draw the line really strong. And I'll show you what I do afterwards. So I draw the line in really strong right now. And then sharply I come down. I lick my brush a little bit again. And this is just what I do. They probably a professional would tell you that this is the wrong way to do it. But whatever and again really sharp line I do the same thing and I sharply come down again here and then I fill it in with just small strokes. Someone's stalking my house phone. Okay, so you see obviously how much thicker and sharper that eyebrow looks. Now that is like pretty intense, right? Okay, and I'm just gonna lick my brush again. Is that nasty that I lick my brush? I don't really care. I'm the only person that licks it. I've been licking this brush for years and I never got sick from it, so I'm pretty sure it's alright. Okay, and I'm just gonna do exactly the same thing on the other one. So, I'm be, yeah, I can look in this mirror and see. And you guys know that saying, right? Eyebrows aren't supposed to be twins, they're supposed to be sisters. So I just want to come up. And 
do it on an angle. I want to add some more. And then at the top. And then once it's all done, I just want to fill it in. Okay, so, if I was a brunette, or a drag queen, I would feel like comfortable leaving my eyebrows like this. You know what I mean? And I know my eyebrows aren't like perfectly symmetrical, and I know you all, the nasty ones out there are like, girl, your eyebrows are not perfect. I don't even think you all that and blah, 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 blah. Well, you know what? Whatever. I know my eyebrows aren't perfect and I know I'm not all that and whatever. So you don't even need to leave your nasty comments because I don't give a shit. So anyways, what I do now is this because I don't like it when my eyebrows are all like hardcore, like so intense like this. I don't even know where the hell that stupid thing went. Um, where's my spoolie thing? I have, oh, here it is. Okay, so usually when my eyebrows are like this, I sort of let it like dry for a minute, and that's when I usually do my mascara part, because I didn't want to do like my full makeup, like, because I'm going to do a tutorial tonight with Black Smokey Eye, because I know I've been like promising you guys that tutorial, because we're going to go out later, but um, I'm going to go out for like my daytime stuff that I got to get done today right now, so whatever. Okay, so then there's my eyebrows like that, so what I do right now is I take my like little spoolie thingy, I want to, oh there it is, you know one of these things? Um... And uh, this is my fake ass MAC brush that I got online. Gotta love it. And um, what I do is I brush this. Like that. You see the difference? So, it gives my eyebrow like shape, gives it definition, and makes it look drawn in and nice and angled and everything, but it doesn't make it look like um, crazy Kim Kardashian drawn on, like, you know? So yeah, and do the same to the other side. And you can just like kind of go in with your finger. And that's basically it. It looks darker, but maybe it's just my lighting right here. But um, yeah, that's generally all I do. So I hope that was helpful to somebody out there. And um, yeah, I will see you guys later. Bye. Have a great day. Oh, maybe I'll zoom this out so you guys can see what it looks like when it's not like straight up all crazy like that. There you go. Okay, see you guys later. Bye.